This is one of a series of presentations about the areas of search that are being put forward in the Welsh Marine Protected Area Network Completion Project. This project is being run by Welsh Government with technical support from Natural Resources Wales and the Joint Nature Conservation Committee. Areas of search are not marine conservation zone site proposals, but represent a step in the process towards designating marine conservation zones within Welsh waters. Here is an illustration of the phase process, moving towards selecting possible MCZs for consultation. We are currently between step two and three in a period of wider engagement on the areas of search to gather additional information on activities and interests. We will be discussing the areas of search with interested sectors, stakeholders and communities and using this information to help mould possible MCZs. Once possible MCZs have been identified with the task and finish group, JNCC and Natural Resources Wales will provide pre-consultation advice ahead of Welsh Government's 12-week public consultation. More information on this can be found on the project's webpage. The shortfall features in Area of Search F are the pink sea fan, shown in the bottom left, and fragile sponge and anthozoan communities found on rock. Pink sea fans are in fact a colony of small anemone-like polyps that emerge from a shared semi-calcareous skeleton. They grow about one centimetre a year and can live for over 50 years. The sea fan provides a home for a tiny sea slug that only eats the sea fan. And they're not necessarily pink. Pink sea fans can be white or orange too. Fragile sponge and anthozoan communities on rock is a community of sponges that grow proud of the seabed and anthozoans such as sea anemones, soft corals and colonial anemones. Some of the sponges can live for decades in a really slow growing. The area of search is found within the Irish Sea off North Pembrokeshire, extending from Abercastle to the east of Strumblehead. It is inshore only. It provides the only opportunity to address the shortfall for pink sea fan and is one of the two opportunities to address the shortfall for fragile sponge and anthozoan communities within the Irish Sea. At the broad area search stage, shortfall features that overlapped with currently licensed activities and existing infrastructure were removed as they are incompatible with an MCZ designation. The area of search overview document shows these activities in more detail and can be found on the project's webpage. The map on the left shows a number of licensed activities in the area, but none of them overlap with the shortfall feature. For each area of search, data was collated on activities that cause pressures to which the shortfall features are sensitive to. However, we do not have comprehensive up-to-date data on all activities to include at this point. We recognise that further discussions are needed to establish key areas for other activities. One data set that we do have is the fishing activity interpreted from vessel monitoring system data, summed from 2016 to 2018, shown on the right here. VMS data is only collected on vessels over 12 metres and some smaller scallop fishing boats. VMS data has limited overlap with the shortfall features in this area of search. We are aware of other fishing activity of under 12 vessels and recreation activities that occur within this area of search. Again, this will be part of wider engagement to get information to feed into the process. For more information about the process, this area of search and other areas that are being put forward and how you can have your say, please visit the project's webpage noted on the screen here. Thank you.